Hi all, welcome back to my channel. Let's learn today how to make green moong dal chilla. It's a great source of protein and is a very healthy option for breakfast. This chilla can be enjoyed with any kind of chutney or you can also serve it with curd just like I did. I have also added paneer which is again a great source of protein. So let's try our hands out on this healthy yet satiating meal. Let's heat up little oil and add 1 tablespoon of jeera and let it crackle. So in the filling I have taken crumbled paneer, ginger, green chilies, onion, capsicum and carrot. You can definitely omit capsicum and carrot and make it with rest of the ingredients. So one by one I am adding the ingredients like one medium sized onion. We'll saute it for like 10 seconds. I am adding green chilies and ginger, both are chopped. Now you can add the vegetables of your choice. Little bit of salt. In powdered spices, I am adding here 1 tablespoon each of red chilli powder turmeric, coriander powder and garam masala. Let's saute the spices for around 30 seconds. Now it's time to add the crumbled paneer. You can also put paneer cubes instead. Let's mix it for a while and your filling is done. So in a mixer grinder, I have taken 1 cup of overnight soaked green moong dal to which I am adding 2 green chilies, 1 small chunk of ginger and little salt. Let's grind it to a smooth paste. I am transferring it into a clean container and the batter for the chilla is ready. Now let's start assembling it. So onto a hot tawa. Slather 1 tablespoon of ghee or you can also use oil. Spread the batter evenly. You can either make it thin or thick based on your taste. I like it thin because it's crispy that way. On medium to high flame, let's cook it for 3 to 2 minutes and add little ghee to make it crispy. You can also add oil if you want. Do not scrape it. Let it leave the sides by its own and check if it is cooked properly from the bottom. It has formed a very nice and crisp layer. And let's flip it to cook it from the other side. As both the sides have been cooked properly, let's add the paneer filling to it. Now fold it and cook it for 20 to 30 seconds and the chilla is ready to dig in. Let's transfer it to a serving plate. Make sure it's served hot and crispy. You can serve it with any kind of dip. I have added little bit of salt and red paprika powder to the yogurt and we are done with the chilla. Not only for breakfast, you can also enjoy it as an evening snack with your favorite cup of chai or coffee. So if you really enjoyed this recipe, do share, like and comment to this video. Thank you guys. Enjoy.